The Grand Tournament, a lit RPG adventure, Tower of Power series, Book 3, by Ivan Cal continues the epic journey of the protagonist, Dave, as he hones his skills and powers in a world that marries the mechanics of role-playing games, RPGs, with real-world adventure and politics. As the third installment in the Tower of Power series, the book sees Dave participating in a highly anticipated tournament that draws participants from various domains, each with their unique abilities and aspirations. The story is set in a fantasy world where individuals can level up their attributes, gain skills, and acquire magical items, much like characters in a traditional RPG. The residents of this world live by the rules and constraints of game-like systems, and combat prowess is often key to survival and advancement. The Grand Tournament offers not only the chance at fame and glory, but also the chance to gain significant power, wealth, and artifacts that can tremendously boost a competitor's abilities. As the novel begins, Dave is still reeling from the events of the previous books where he and his friends, a group of adventurers he's banded with, have faced harrowing challenges. Dave has significantly grown in power, having obtained the rank of Viscount and possessing an array of formidable skills and assets. His group includes powerful allies, each with their own specializations and backstories that contribute to the dynamic of the team. The Grand Tournament is not just a test of individual strength, but also of strategy, teamwork, and adaptability. Dave and his party prepare meticulously for the event, training in their respective fields and studying their potential opponents. It is a complex game of chess, where understanding the competition is as valuable as brute strength. They learn of different factions and challengers, each presenting a different set of threats and opportunities. Previous relationships and rivalries among competitors also play a role, as political alliances and ancient feuds come to the fore. As the tournament unfolds, Dave discovers that there is more at stake than he initially realized. Nefarious plots are afoot, and there are those who seek to use the tournament for their own dark purposes. Dave and his companions must navigate through a web of deceit, betrayal, and manipulation, setting aside personal ambition for the greater good. He encounters a host of unique characters, from honorable knights to cunning sorcerers, all vying to claim the top prize for their economies. Battles in the tournament range from duels to large-scale team engagements, with each presenting its own set of unique challenges. Dave's ability to adapt and learn from his experiences is tested to the utmost. His leadership skills are also put to the test as he guides his team through the perils of the competition, with each battle offering a chance to gain new insights and skills, plus the vital experience points required to level up. Throughout the tournament, Dave's relationship with his teammates deepens as trust and camaraderie are forged in the heat of battle. He finds himself relying not just on his combat abilities, but also on his diplomatic and leadership skills to unite and inspire his allies towards victory. Love interests and friendships add complexity to the protagonist's motivations, serving as both strengths and vulnerabilities. As the tournament reaches its climax, Dave is faced with powerful entities and masterminds that threaten to overturn the foundations of the world. He clashes with adversaries who have their own unique styles and powers, many of whom harbor long-standing grudges or alliances that complicate the bouts. The finals of the tournament are as much about wit and strategy as they are about physical and magical might. Dave's journey is fraught with close calls, unexpected twists, and the ever-present danger of death. In this lit RPG world, death can have real and lasting consequences, adding tension and stakes to every confrontation. The protagonist and his companions also grapple with moral choices and the consequences of their actions both inside and outside the arena. The titular Grand Tournament is not only a spectacle of combat, but also serves as a backdrop for character development and world building. As the narrative unfolds, readers learn more about the history, politics, and cultures of the different realms that make up the story's world. The social structures and power dynamics of the world are explored, giving depth to the setting and the actions of its inhabitants. The rules of the lit RPG genre are cleverly woven into the story, embracing concepts such as leveling up, skill acquisition, and item crafting. These mechanics serve to enhance the immersive quality of the narrative, 
allowing readers to experience the growth and progression of the characters in a quantifiable way. The integration of these systems into the plot and character arcs makes the reader feel like a part of this game-like reality. The book culminates with the end of the tournament, which results in both expected and surprising outcomes. Victories are won, alliances are tested, and the true intentions behind the tournament's inception are revealed. With the tournament concluded, Dave and his team are left to ponder its repercussions on their personal lives and on the balance of power within the wider world. As expected for a series, the conclusion of the grand tournament sets the stage for further adventures. There are threads left to be explored, and mysteries remain unsolved, ensuring readers' anticipation for the next installment. Dave emerges from the tournament changed, not only in power and status, but also in his understanding of the world and his place within it. By the end of the novel, Dave's story has become one of not just personal achievement, but also of the impact one individual can have on a complex, interactive universe. The Grand Tournament challenges the characters and provides ample opportunity for excitement, growth, and the promise of even grander adventures to come. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.